Hello. We're back for another episode. This week I'm not going to do the intro because, well, it was it was pretty atrocious, wasn't it? Never mind, though. We can always find something new in the future. I know I said that every episode of the Steam FC save mode. But there you go. We will find something. We'll find something. We'll find something. Uh, but for now, let's get on with it. By the way, though, if you're wondering, I know this has changed behind me. That is actually a TV that I hung just like some blankets and some scarves on. Now it's just facing over there towards my bed. That's why that looks weird. You didn't need to know that, but now you do. Ha! Thanks. Three little magpies. Hello, welcome back. It's me and the Newcastle team. I am going to spare you that intro because... Well, quite frankly, you don't need to hear that more than once. We'll work on intro music again. I said that for last year's Football Manager series, but this year, I really mean it. Somewhat. Never mind. Anyway, um, you'll notice that our match today isn't against Aston Villa. We have, in fact, already played them. The reason I changed things is because we got through the uh, Capital One Cup. Barely. Um, bloody good performance by the defence there. Fantastic work all round. Like the rest of the team, marvellous. Like, what a, what a game they had, apart from Aaron's. But the defence just didn't really feel like it on the day, I guess. And Barbie had the best game out of all the defence, and that, that tells you all you need to know, really, doesn't it? Um, but yeah, we did make it through eventually. Um, but let's go back a bit further. Matt Everton fucked us a little bit. Um, on the upside, Iose Perez got his third of the season. Let's not talk about it anymore. We beat Aston Villa. Why now done with two? A uh, good game for him. And then, obviously, we got the draw for the Capital One Cup. And we got drawn against these guys. So that's why I didn't do the Aston Villa match or transfer deadline day. Um, because we got drawn against Sunderland. And I thought Chelsea, Tottenham, Sunderland, what an episode. And... Really not a lot happened on Transfer Deadline Day. The only thing I did was try and move on Marvo, and nobody wants him. So he's still here somewhere, kicking about. Won't do a lot. I'm not going to give him any games. Um, and um, we brought in one extra place on loan, Jordan Much, in for the season, just to give some support for the centre midfielders. A uh, bit of a backup sort of guy. A bit of a backup sort of guy is what I'm saying there, yeah. That's what he's doing here. Um, other than that, no, no, no ins or outs that day or since. So, hooray. Here you got Charlie Adam. Wouldn't that be nice? But we didn't. Anyway, this is the team that's going out today in the first match against Chelsea. Um, Chelsea. It's a very similar team to the team that you saw last time against Manchester United. And that's because, well, it worked. So, hmm. Zivkovic uh, is one starter this time out. Uh, Zivkovic, obviously one of the players we saw brought in last time round. Um, he's there on the right-hand side. Thorvin will start this time. Wijnaldum keeps his place as an advanced playmaker. Uh, Mitrovic is not the target man again. Romero is starting as Roman playing. Tiote with a ball winning midfielder role. Um, Arias and Haidara are defensive wing-backs. We'll see how that works against the likes of Hazard, who in this game is still existent. Um, um, but um, Bemba's playing covering centre defence. Balan needs to up his game. Uh, limited defender. Defend. Uh, the bench, we got Woodman, Reekings, Lascelles, Anita, Sizoko, Barboza and Perez. And these guys. Uh, on the upside, Tim Krull is nearly back from injury. So he can stop playing Kyle Darlow. That's enough of rambling about the team. Let's get into the match. Oh, yes. And I forgot to mention, we are going counter-attacking a bit deeper. When we do get the ball, be more disciplined, close them down, a higher tempo, direct passing, hit early crosses. So basically, get it forward as quickly as you possible. Possible As quickly as you possible, is what I just said there. When you get the ball, lads, get the ball. When you get the ball... I'm just going to stop talking, move on. You get the idea with the instructions. Let's go. Oh, I just realised I've got to show you the team. So here it is on this tiny screen over here. Uh, Courtois, Babaraman, John Terry, Cahill, Yam, Matt. Barstead. Ramirez, Matic, Hazard, Oscar, William, and Falcao. Aha, we're fine. 
I'm joking. I know he's good in the game. Come on, lads. Pick up where you left off. I got faith in your faces. And I'm losing all of my doubts. We just kicked off. Or they did, actually. Oh, they look a bit tired. Well, we kicked off. Um, this highlight's... No, oh, there it is. Oh, no. Early highlight. 39 second free kick. Uh, hopefully this is a counter. That'd be great, wouldn't it? It's, it's not going to be a counter at all, is it? Uh, Matic. Um, coming inside. He's, he's closed down very quickly. Baba Raman. No, no. Now he's left his man. You've left a man too early. We've got rid of it a bit. But it's going to come straight back at us eventually, Ramirez. Baba Raman. Baba. Baba. I'm just going to call him Baba from now on. Baba. Into Oscar. Into Falcao. Falcao is going to get a shot away. Darlo. It was going wide, but, you know. Good effort. Uh, corner comes in. Clear it, Teote. Can we clear it again? Oh, we are inviting a lot of pressure onto us. And our defence, I've seen over the past few days. Days? Games are still not the strongest point. A lot of pressure in these opening three minutes. So, still dealing with that. Ramirez to Cahill. That to Yamabu. Even though we're at Stamford Bridge, there's like one corner of, 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 the, of the stadium. Just like, boo. Oh, Falcao scored. Well, that's shit. Shit. As you can see here, what happens is uh, Willian doesn't get closed down. He crosses it in. And Belanta, what are you doing? Who, why are you giving him so much room, Belanta? It's all your fault. Hazard, they're going to come straight at us again. Hazard is doing what he did last season, but not this season. And Carl, you can't be beaten at your near post like that. That is embarrassing, Carl. <sighs> Where is Tim? Where is Tim? And uh, as you can see, yeah, I'm not, I don't know. And, oh, it's not Azpilicueta this year, doing the long throws, it's Baba. Hazard works it through Ramirez, it's blocked, it's coming straight back out to Hazard. Hazard, um, feeds it into John Terry. What are we doing? Come on. Bull, shitty, fucky shit, fucking shit and fuckle. And we've got another Chelsea highlight. This game is so thrilling for me to sit here. And as I keep changing things and nothing has any effect, I wonder what is the point of living. They've had to go all the way back to Courtois, so that's nice. The ball's actually in there half for once. Shame we still haven't got it. I mean... Oh, we've got the ball! We've got the ball! Thorvin! Ryan Aldum! Here we go! We can maybe do something. Mitrovic moves forward, looks forward. Can he see that? Any option? No. He's hacked down by John Terry. That's a red. Send him off, ref. That was awful. Go on. I can't see any other reason for this highlight. It is a red card. We've done it. We've got a man advantage. Now we just got to come back. Come on, lads. Show me something that... Show me that you want to play football here. Uh, it's going to be another Chelsea goal, isn't it? I mean, where... Who is... What was... There was two of you there. And neither of you stopped that happening. Neither of you stopped that happening. I mean... Right. Half time. I told them that they were shit. And I've also made a triple substitution. Meekings is on instead of Arias. Because... Well, that, that, that chance just before half time. I, we were... We have a man up, and he just let Hazard go. And I could not have somebody who's going to let Hazard go. Just playing there all day. So Megan is on, even though he's not very good at that role. He's going to have a go. Barboza and Perez are also both on, because I've seen nothing from the front four. So let's see if they can spice things up a bit. Off we go! And th there's a highlight. What's it going to be? Chelsea have got the ball, so that's... I don't know where the defence are. I don't know what they're doing. I don't know why they're even bothering to show up today. Oh, Meekings, that's poor. Everybody, that's poor. Well done, Darlow. You managed to catch a ball. I, I'm so proud of you. Right, so we've got a highlight. We, we've got a highlight where we're actually in control of the ball at the start. I've changed things up a bit. We're now in control. 
I've told it to pass into space. We're actually doing something. Perez has been saved by Courtois. Damn Chelsea having a good goalkeeper. I hate it when teams do that. Um, but the ball there has gone all the way through and Perez apparently is punched a bit. Or, or, or like pulled someone's head. I don't know what he did in there. But he's done something and I've kept on talking because the highlight's carrying on. And Diego Costa, well there's somebody who will pull your hair and punch you a bit. Uh, horrible footballer. I'm joking. He can, he can score when he wants. Um, as William scores instead. 4-0. It's 10 men. What are we doing? Why? Why has this happened? Why are we shit? I know there's a highlight. I just don't want to say anything anymore. There's just no point. Why? Ugh. Ugh. I have no faith in these players anymore. I mean, we have Tottenham next, and I just saw that they beat someone 5 0 as well when Lamella scored 4. What are you doing, Darlo? Catch that! You fucking idiot! I'm swearing a lot that this is going to happen and you're going to have to get used to it. Look at that. It's the last highlight of the game and they're still having chances. That was appalling. No, I can't fault them. That was awful. I've never seen such a shit performance. Why a fucking Chelsea exist? Bastards. All right. It's time for the... Next match in the Premier League against Tottenham Hotspur. I really want to beat these motherfuckers. Um, should stop swearing as much. I apologise greatly, immensely. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. So much. But yeah, um, changed the team up a little bit today. As you can see, we're going with a slightly different formation. No attacking midfielder, having a four-one-two-three sort of thing. It's basically a four-three-three, but a bit more, you know. Flying V-shaped. Perez is back in. Um, as is Scarpa. Thorvin keeps... Well, not his place. He was out on the left last time. But he's out on the right this time. Uh, Wijnaldum and Sissoko stay in the middle. Well, not stay in the middle. Sissoko's back in the middle. And Tiote holds down there. Ball winning. Uh, Balanta drops to the bench. Colacini takes his place. Put in a really bad shift against Millwood. Colacini. But, you know, against Balanta's recent performances, you can't do much worse, can you? So, let's see what happens. Right, here we can see the uh, opposition team. Um, there is... Uh, where is he? I can't see him today. There is no... What's his face? I've forgotten his name because he scared me. Lamella. He's not here. That's great news. Um, Dembele and Bentaleb, though. Eriksen. Chadley. Hommin. Kane. I Kane. Remember from last year. He's got better since then, actually. Um, which is scary because huh, he was pretty good. Never mind, let's carry on. Right, team talk's done. I've told them to go out there and show the world they've got what we've got his takes. Yeah, that's what I said to them. See if it pays off ever at all. Uh, we're doing the May United thing again. Last match, I think there was too much instructions and too much Chelsea. So we're going back to very basic, 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 basic football. Disciplined. Normal tempo, mixed passing, normal, everything's normal, just a bit more disciplined. That's what I want to see. More discipline, put in a shift and beat them. Or draw. Beat them, maybe. You know, it's White Hart Lane. Anybody can win here. <laughs> yes, I'm an Arsenal fan. Shut up. Yep, first highlight of the first half now. And it looks like it might be going to Tottenham. Um, ben Selev throws himself over to Thorvin there. Um, just to let you know, by the way, um, Tiote was yellow carded within a minute and a half this game. Um, so, standout performance. Eriksen went to the side netting. Not good enough defensively again. Ugh, centre backs are always letting us down so far this season. Hydara out on that left hand side just doesn't seem to know what he's doing in terms of playing football matches. Because every match now he's either. Ha oh my. Every match, Hydara, every match. Dummett's back soon, so that's good. We'll play Dummett soon. Hi, Dara, you silly, silly man. Yeah, Dyer into Chadley. Where, where is everybody? Who was that? Thorvin. 
What are you doing playing him on side and then pretending you don't defend? <sighs> Show me something else. Twats. Right, double substitution. Throwing Barboza onto the right. Thorvin moves out to the left instead. Mitrovic up front as a target man. And we're going counter-attacking with a few more direct balls. Let's see if anything can... Can we do anything? No, they, we've given away another corner. Uh, Newcastle, Newcastle, Newcastle. There is a lot of work to do here, isn't there? Yes, there is. Clearly, there is a lot of work to do because these guys cannot play football. Hmm. And after the Man United result, I had so much faith. And all of that has just been shot down in two games. And with the derby up next... Wh why are you going, Darlow? He shot, like, pretty much where you were. Why do you need to dive? Hydara, you... Call it... Why, defenders? Can you not play football? They've got another highlight. They're passing around us like we're not even there. We, we do, we're, we're pretty much not there at this point. Well done, Hydara. Walks past the challenge, and it's back in. 3-0. 3-0. Oh, I hate this game so much. All right, I'm going to make a substitution. Thorvin's got a 4.6. I don't know what we can do at this point. So, Jordan Much, here's your first start. Wijnaldum out to the that side, inside forward. Give it a go. Much is an advanced playmaker. Can we do anything? Who knows? Probably not. And got a highlight. It's probably theirs, so I'm not even going to bother getting excited. Bentaleb to Ericsson. Ericsson out to Townsend. Townsend moving forward down the right-hand side. Well, for them, anyway. Oh, it's a beautiful win to Kane. Kane ditches two defenders like they're not even there. Well done, lads. You are being dropped, and I'm going to find your wages. You don't deserve to be paid. Just, just awful, really. Awful. I don't know how to make them better. That was awful. Again, so fucking terrible. Uh, update. Tiote is not going to be playing against Sunderland because he already has five yellow cards. It's it's not even the end of the September yet. Good job, Tiote. Good job. Ready to rumble. That's what we are. I suppose we we are anyway now. I, this is this is as close as we're getting. Um, team that will start today when we're playing four four fucking two, as is once quoted from a movie. That sentence didn't make much sense. All right, here we go. Cruel is back in goal. He's not match fit, but he's playing because Carl Darlow needs to go away. Arias, uh, Haidara keep their places. Arias is hit and miss. Haidara is mainly miss. Meat and Bemba keeps his place because he puts in average performances every week. Doesn't do a huge amount wrong, but it needs to get better. Otherwise, he will be replaced. Meekings is in as another centre-back loses a chance because Colacini is awful. Balant has been awful. Lascelles is up next if Meekings doesn't do that great. So, you know, here we go. Uh, in the midfield, we've got Scarpa on the left, uh, Sizoko on the right. In the middle, we've got Wijnaldum going forward, playing the balls. Callback sitting back, trying to sweep stuff up because Tiote is a silly man. And up front, we're playing two up front to see how that works in Perez and Barboza. You're thinking, why isn't Mitrovic up there being the target man to knock it down to the other one? No, he can come on later if I feel like it. Um... So let's get into it, I guess. Also, we're going control because it's Sunderland. We should be able to control Sunderland. Higher tempo, more direct passing. Look for the overlap. More closing down. Slightly higher line. Don't mess it up. Otherwise, the fans will have my bollocks. And I leg my bollocks firmly where they are. Thank you, lads. All right, then. Here is the Sunderland team. As you can see... Nine, def yeah, nine defenders and Defoe, uh, and Manoni's in goal. Um, so you know, good positive play from Sam Allardyce as usual. And I've told them they need to step up their game to end the recent results. 
and only two of them seem motivated by it. Oh, well, this has been the problem with Newcastle for years, hasn't it? They just have people rather than players. Okay, we've got the ball. Sizoko moving forward. Why now? Oh, good ball out to Arias. Arias, look, in the, look inside. Look in the box. Look in the box. It's over to Scarpa. Scarpa's on the end of the box. Scarpa hits it at the keeper twice. Oh, Scarpa. Hit it back across again. You've got two strikers on the field today. Both of them waiting in the middle there. But, no. Okay. Free kick. Edge of the area. Mbemba hits it in. Cleared. Only as far as Mbemba again. Hits it back to Sizoko. Sizoko's taken down. And don't let them counter, for God's sake. Uh, I look disappointed over there, don't I? I am. I'm disappointed here as well. It's Defoe. Somebody take him down. He's like two foot tall. Kick him. Kick him. He's two foot tall. Ah, oh, but no, we let them carry on. They're through. They've scored. Load of shit. All right. We've got a... Hi, light. So, well, it's for us so far, at least. Straight after kickoff from that goal. Meeking springs it forward a bit. He's going to do something with it eventually. Pass to Wijnaldum, into Gabriel Barbosa. Over to the Scarpa. Scarpa. With an early ball into Perez. Oh, why can't our goalkeepers do that? That was a fantastic save. Uh, half time, nothing happened. Just. Uh, show me some desire. It's the derby. Damn it. And we're sat here like lemons. The only chance we've had, Scarpa smashed it against the woodwork. Well, not the woodwork, the keeper, and then the side netting. Everything else has been nothing. Nothing else. There has been nothing else. You guys are shit. Sort it out. There's a highlight of some description. I just don't believe it's ours anymore. I just don't believe it anymore because, well, we've been that shit. Oh, what a hit by Scarpa, and Barbosa's just nowhere for the rebound. Nowhere at all. There's a second highlight. Do something with it, Barbosa. Into Wijnaldum. Wijnaldum looking for Bar Romero, who's come on, by the way. I've changed it a little bit. Wingers are further forward. A ball by the... Then Perez. Oh, my goodness. Can we just score? It should be 3-1 by now. It should be 3-1. We just can't seem to get it in the net. And that's a free kick to them. Um, well, oh, we've got the pullback. Iose, forward. Mitrovic runs onto it. Mitrovic, do something. Please, be the magic man. You'll get the start next game. Zivkovic, who I've just brought on as well. He's in. He's in straight the keeper. And it's cleared again, of course. It was a good breakaway, but nothing. Still, Zivkovic hits it into the middle corner. Romero gets it on the edge of the area. Romero tries to go around the right-hand side. Lens tackles him. See, their attackers can tackle our midfielders. Why can't we tackle Defoe? Speaking of Defoe, here he is. And Bemba clears up. And up. Oh. Well, I wasn't even really paying that much attention. But now we're 2-0 down. Ah. Uh. So, it's a simple set piece. The free kick comes in. Nobody's marking Tovenine. Krull jumps as high as his little injured frame will take him. But, we fucked it, guys. Well done. Well done. And here's the token highlight. I'll meet you at the end of the match. There's no point watching this. Ugh. Well, there you go. There's another episode. You know, I was having a really good day. I was quite happy before I started filming this episode. And then... Yeah. I was having a good day. And now I feel like shit. This, this series may well be over very soon if this continues. Maybe fired before January. Wouldn't surprise me. If you like this, and why would you... I mean, for fuck's sake, the only clean sheet we've kept all season was against Man United, but yet we can't score in three matches. I know that two of them are top teams, but the predictions are saying we, they had us down as a draw, and we complained like we weren't even bothered. <sighs> See you next time.